Hello, welcome to the stream. Hello, welcome to the stream. Oh, Jill's working. <laughs> Thanks very much uh, for joining here tonight. Okay, uh, new game tonight. Uh, not Monster Hunter World, that, that was advertised. Um, you know, like I said, fancy playing something else, to be honest with you today. And after that silent house last night, I, I kind of got into the, like, like yeah, I want to play a few more, you know, like, no adventure puzzle, uh, kind of maybe hobby games as well. Um, I thought it was like pretty good, even though it was a bit broken English. I, I actually really enjoyed it. The stream really enjoyed it, being able to get involved as well. So, and this is uh, hark back to what we was originally playing uh, last year. That you know a lot of people just really liked the stream for. Um, you know, but lately we've been playing a couple, of, you know, uh, you know maybe AAA games like Monster World and you know. Um, Power worlds and stuff like that, and, and I really enjoy them games. But I, I think for like a day or two, uh, I'm gonna be just playing like these kind of like you know games. Uh, so anyway, yeah, let's get into the adventure. The game's called The Night Is Grey. I'm not gonna tell you a lot about this game because I do not want to spoil it. But let's just say we are in for an adventure. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Well, I'm just going to quickly set up the options and then just tell me if it's like uh, good sound and a good audio and stuff like that. I think, I think I'm going to maybe music down a little bit, but we'll, we'll turn the SFX on. Okay. Okay, I'm not even going to put House of Play or anything like that. I'm just, just going to go straight to the game. I've never played this before. It's a brand new game for me. I've literally just bought it. Um, it's been on my radar for not that long. It's, it has only just come out this year. Can't quite remember when. Um, but yeah, look, it's good. If you don't behave, the wolves will come at night. They will take you away. And as you scream, I'll be laughing the whole time with no love to give. Do you hear me? You spoiled little brat. Straight away, dark. What the hell? I gotta get out of here. Some someone there. Yeah, let's go towards the crack, shall we? The house. I wonder. <sighs> Nothing scary about a creaky door that's open in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Hello? Someone there? Um, anybody home? Stop right there. Oh, fire. I have a gun. Whoa, don't shoot. Hi. Are you? Are you just a kid? I'm a person that has a gun, and you don't scare me, monster. Uh, I'm not a monster. Go away, monster. Thanks for the bit. Ah. 
Um, not a monster. And don't shoot, please. Yeah, right. I just... There you go, just there you go. Not so bad the music actually, I kind of like it. Uh, you all alone here? In the dark? By yourself? No, I have Mr. Shotgun with me. <laughs> and if you don't want him to be mad, don't step any closer. I swear, it's okay. I'm a person, like you. Ah. Nice try, monster. Uh. That's not... Is that just a toy you're holding? Do you really want to find out? <laughs> Don't be scared, it's just dark. Why is it so dark? The lights went out. Mummy went to fix that with the gin. The, the, the gen. The janitor. She'll be here in no time. And then you'll really be in trouble. Uh, how long has she been gone? Uh, I see. She usually takes that key in a box over by the cabinet. This time she forgot though. But she'll come back for it any second now. Did you make noise in the woods? Were you just in the woods right now? Yeah, that was me. Oh. I was looking for mummy when I saw you, monster. Mummy warned me there were bo a buggy a bogeyman in the woods. Um, what? I'm a person. It's just dark out there. No. I saw you. You were big and fairy. <laughs> I'm just an adult and I have a beard. <laughs> you have shiny eyes. What? My glasses? They, they were just reflecting the moon, probably. Shut up. You're a monster. Hi, <laughs> uh, right, Anthony, mate. Uh, I can't leave you here in the dark. Look, you can't be here alone like this. I'll just turn the lights on and you'll see there's no reason to be afraid. Uh, okay. If you help mummy and make the lights go on, and you're not a monster, then I won't shoot you. <laughs> okay, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Right, okay, better take that key she mentioned. What was it there? Okay. Okay, let's get the key. So this is the box you were telling me about. Yeah. Just making sure. Okay, so... We're in the woods. We've just started this game. Um, people that have just joined in. It's called... Um, it's called again? Uh, the Knights of Grey. Um, we're, we're in the woods. Um, we don't know why we're in the woods. We've heard a, we've heard a crack. Um, we've decided to follow it. And there's a young girl, as you've just seen there, in a cabin in the middle of the woods, holding a shotgun, basically telling us that I'm a monster. So we've now got to prove that I am not a monster by getting the generator up and getting the electricity to the house. She won't budge. I could use a smoke. Okay, so right mouse button to inspect items, hotspots, and characters. Right. It's the last one. And I know I'm a lighter. I'll save it for as long as I can then. Better go fix that generator. Uh, so we might need petrol. Well, this one's empty. Not even a drop in that one. Whoa, it's a mirror. Oh no, it's just a garbage can. <laughs> I can see you. Stay away. That kid's got trust issues. It's just, it's just, just dust. I bet it's empty. Oh, this one still has some gas after all. 
Right, because usually uh, generators they need gasoline. Let's have a look. So much land to plot land stuff. They still stick plants in tiny clay gauges. Okay, so we'll get somewhere here. A mailman comes all the way out here to deliver mail. Let's write mass button on pass to fat travel. Alright. I guess they really take their muscle seriously. Well, the mailman don't take their muscle that seriously. It's empty, aside from dust. Thanks for the chair. Locked. Why would it even be locked? There's no one around for miles. It's not like someone would just come up here and try to... Oh. <laughs> what was she saying? There's bound to be something useful in there. Okay, so what have we got? Right, it's a small metal box. There's something inside. Okay, let's have a look at the box. Ah, we okay, we got some keys. Yeah, the kid was right. Okay, so we got keys. Alright, guess that one solved. Ah, right, here we go. Damn, no power, okay. I can't see a goddamn thing. Sweet. I love duct tape. It's probably the most useful thing in our universe. Okay, so we've got some duct tape. So this is a, a mole. This is how a mole sees things. A bat would see better than this. At least they have some, have a sonar or something. Right, so we can't see anything else in there at the moment because it's too dark. So we've got some duct tape. Is that about it? Someone had a lot of work chopping all these trees. Alright, so where is this, um, where's the generator? Risk of land force, is that why they closed the path down? No way I'm going through that, poison ivy. It seems to be an abandoned path. Who does poison ivies? Ah, uh, okay. Probably in your own casket now, tree. I see the generator is going to be close. It's going to be close to here somewhere. Let's go back this way, the way we came from running. Let's have a little look around. Maybe they've gone away by now. Bridge Road is safer anyway. Should first check if they're still there. What are they? Well, we were running from something, but we don't know what. Oh, okay. We were running from wolves. Okay. They're still here. Family eats together, stays together. I gotta get out of this place. I could throw these rocks at them, but pissing my pants would be more effective <laughs> and closer to happening. No way I'm going back there. It's glowing an incredible way tonight. Kinda wish I had my camera with me. Uh, okay, so it's not that way. So can we go this way now? Yeah, we can go this way. Okay, here we go. This looks like a generator. How the hell did I get into this mess, Graham? Okay, here's the deal. Keep talking to yourself and making dumb jokes. So you don't have to go totally crazy. You can fall apart later. Just help the girl out and never come back. Do it step by step. Fix the generator first. 
Okay, Graham, let's do this. Well, it's totally unusable if you squint your eyes. The one was doing a crappy job at fixing it, though. Alright, let's, let's have a look around. Yeah, definitely generator. Alright, let's start. What was it? Okay. I like how you, I like how you found it automatically. You're like, yeah, yeah, but I'll use it for my glasses. If one of these falls down around here, I wonder how long it takes for someone to come up here and fix it. I mean, everything breaks down eventually. Everything. All right. All right, generator. puzzles let's see if I can make this work so we gotta okay we're gonna take that off uh, dry then roll kill left in the sun okay so we're gonna use that in there gasoline just the water mechanical that's Okay, and we're going to turn it on, and then we're going to rip the cord. Not a thing I break. Come on. Someone's not right here. Ah. So, right, that's a walk. Okay, we've got a belt. That's broken. So I call it my self-esteem. So we can... we do that? Yeah, we can do that. Okay. Do you think myself seeing the other two little time to recover? Okay, we can put the fixed belt back on there. This should do the trick. Oh, let's pull it all on. Hands. Rip it. Rip it. Huh? Ah, there we go. There we go. I was clicking the picture. Hopefully that doesn't um, make them wolves come with it being like pretty loud. Great, something worked out for me for a change. Okay, let's get out of here. Never seen the lighthouse from over here. Okay. That's why I look around everywhere, isn't it? Right, so we know down here there's a trail, but it's got poison ivy. Take that, Edison. Oh, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Before we go back, before we go back. There was stuff in here, wasn't there? But we couldn't see it. I'll be able to see it now. Just, just, uh, we click on this. Yeah, that makes sense. That's a lot less dust than everything else in here. It's a teddy bear of some sort. I was thinking maybe we can take that, the missing handle. Still, maybe I could use that old saw up there. Hmm, but it's too high up. Uh, can we throw that at it? Nope. do anything in there yet then but that's too high up but there's a saw in there and there is a teddy bear in there but that might be for the girl but maybe not yet at least the lights are on we got some we got some electricity can i come in don't shoot me please i'm not a uh... where are you That was just a broom, huh? That wasn't even a gun. Yeah, but I scared you. <laughs> You're no monster. 
Yo, we missed there. Uh, missed there. Uh. Did you see mummy? Oh. Right. Your mum's missing, huh? Yep. Has she been gone a while? Yep. Did she go out there? Yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> then, uh, oh. No, I didn't see her. Oh. Maybe I can see her from outside the house. Well, I don't really think so. And maybe you're going outside. It's not a, such a great idea. Well, the kids can't believe me. You see, the thing is, right now can be a bit dangerous. Damn kids. Well, let's have a look around before. Oh, it's not really the right time to write grocery lists. No family pictures, no people. Just pictures of boats and the stay. I kind of do recognize the large one in the middle. Uh, yeah, it's the lighthouse. Ah, oh, it's the lighthouse. It looks different. This put you must be old. Okay. The spring in which we saw each other's lights, GP. Is there anything I can click on that? Else around there. The, the butter knife has a huge handle. Might still be useful, unlike me. There we go. We'll have a little. What's in there? Slots. Maybe the kid wasn't supposed to get in there for some reason. Huh. It smells kind of bad. It's been bubbling for a while. Must got shot with a broom. My eyesight must be getting worse. Good thing the kid was able to keep warm. Got the door. All these doors are locked, the front door's wide open, but the doors inside are locked. Nothing here fits me and the girl. Doesn't cut anything. Can it be even used as a knife? Huh? Pretty big. I bought a knife. What if we can use it to open up the door? Probably just end up with a locked door and a broken knife. I might still need it. Okay. Well, right, let's go outside then and see where the girl went. Oh, there she is. Hey. I'm Graham, by the way. I'm Hannah. Do you like pears? Uh, I think. Sure. Nothing wrong with them. Well, if you don't like them, there's something wrong with you. They're my favourite fruits. Do you have any? Uh, do you have any? Do you have pears? I'm afraid not, kids. Mommy sure is late for dinner. Kids. Do you live here with anyone else but Mummy? It's me and Mummy. All the way. She has dark stars in her face. She has dark stars in her face. With long hair, that's the colour off those trees. So, what does that mean? Like, freckles and a brunette? That's what I said. <laughs> she... Do you have some other place you have dinner at? Other family? Granny and Grandpa. Well, I haven't seen them for a long time. They live in a village. All the way on the other edge of the forest, you know. Uh, How do you usually get there? Mum never takes me anywhere. She used to go by boat because it was quicker. But the crappy thing is busted. No other way. Sure, the bridge path. It's long and dull. Mummy hates it. Oh. Um. That path's not really safe. I saw some wolves there. Oh. So where's Mummy? Look, kids. 
Neither of us should really stay here longer. Even your house isn't totally safe. We need to get out of here now. What do you say? I take you to your grandparents' house. No, I can't leave. What if Mummy comes back and I'm not here? She'd be really mad at me. Hmm. Hey. I bet you that your mummy is at your grandparents' house right now. What if she's waiting there for you so you can have all dinner? I'm sure that they'll have all the pears you might want. I'll take you there. Maybe. How would we get there? Don't worry, I'm on it. I'll stay on the lookout. Just in case mummy comes back. You still afraid of me? You're not scared of me anymore? Haha, <laughs> no mister. You're just silly. Oh, how am I silly? Ha <laughs> ha uh, You have a nice home. So, uh, that's a nice home. Are you giving me the, the attitude? <laughs> what? <laughs> Mummy says that's this, 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 this respectful. What? Commenting on your home? No, giving attitudes. Are you being mean? I'm not giving you anything. I'm just saying you have a nice home. I think. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's our home. I like to play outside and watch the fireflies. They're pretty like fairies. They? Sure are. Uh, okay, what about the path behind the bushes? Hey. I saw an old clothes path. Oh, yeah. I remember Mummy saying something about it. She was angry. Do you know why? No. But she said it was a, it was dangerous. I think somebody died there a long time ago. Yes. We can ask that again? Hey. So no close part. Okay, that's the same question. She was angry. Do you know why? No, because she said it was dangerous. I think somebody died there a long time But it's still there. The other ones have disappeared. Okay. Uh, I need your help reaching the place, kids. How do you feel about a piggy back ride? Yay! I love those. Come, piggy, piggy, piggy. Well, I, you. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we're going to get the saw. We can use the saw to cut the ivy. You're lucky, you're cute kids. Stalky! Quick, mister, let me grab him. And there you go. Nice, she's got him. Right. Hey, kids. Have you gotten your tentacle sh uh, tetanus shot? I didn't shoot anything. It was a broom, remember? Ah, uh -huh. yeah. Stint you at all now. How about you give me a hand and reach towards the old saw with both hands? Okay. Here you go, mister. My mummy says you shouldn't play with sharp objects. Yeah, but I think she might see this as an exception. Don't worry. All right, so I think we have to put the handle of the knife on, on the saw. We can use it. That would be guessing. Hey, mister. You're good at fixing stuff, right? Uh, I guess. Could you pretty please take Storky and fix him for me? Uh, what are you toy? Right now? I, I don't think so, kid. You have it. Come on. I want to go around with a children's teddy. No. Please. I got urgent stuff to do, kids. Really, please. <laughs> kid, I'm telling you, this doesn't matter right now. And your doll seems fine enough. The answer is no. <laughs> this is like an awkward moment here. Uh, uh, please! God damn it! Fine! I suppose I can try if I find the right materials. Okay, thanks! But first, you have to promise. Promise to give him back after you fix him. You promise? Why would I want to keep your doll? Mummy well, we took Stocky away when I was bad. And she promised to give him back. But she never did. You have to give him back to me, please. I. <laughs> Oops. 
sure. I promise to give it back. Be good, Storky. Yeah, ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, I'll be good. Haha, <laughs> Billy Bird. Wasn't even being funny. So let's have a look at the bird first. Well, hello there. Come on, man. I'm Storky the bird. Yes, you are. And I hate you. I hate you too. Like every, everyone else in this world. You don't know anything. There's no wonder the mum locked it in the bloody thing. It wasn't the kid. It was the Storky. Oh, sure. A dirty, dumb little bird. Yeah, but you're the one who's talking to me. So who's dumb now? Touche, little bird. Touche. Alright, so maybe we can... There's no way to properly fix the dumb thing. Not that I even want to. To put that duct tape on your mouth. Your breath stinks. How about I shut your mouth? Who do want to talk to you then? <laughs> what the hell is going on? Right, okay. Oh, we've... Okay, that, that, that. It's almost useful, which means it's not useful at all. That's that. Okay. If only people stuck together as well as stuck tape. And then that to that. Hope this works. Got to be careful not to touch anything with my hands. I can't believe I made that work. You did something good for once, Graham. Who knew? Ah, this saw is barely usable and all rusty. I'm not carrying a big pile of trash with me everywhere I go. But I think I'll keep the butter knife. Oh, let's go until it says I've got to go back for the girl. Why did it have to be this place? Anyway, that's steep. Why, why is it going on about this place for? Uh, uh, once we can't go, once we go down there, we can't come back. Oh, we can easily go up there. Look at it. It's not happening, steep, mate. The walls might get us. I'll take the kids to her grandparents' house. It's the least I can do. Right, okay, then. So we're gonna go back, get the kids. And then once we go down there, we can't go back, but okay. Hey kids. Mister, I saw a wolf. Where? You fell for it. Haha. <laughs> you were so scared. Funny. Did you say something about wolves? Hey, you mentioned something about wolves. Have you ever seen them coming around here? I've never seen one. My mummy told me they live in the forest. They're really scary. Yeah. That big thief that jumped down a lot, kid. Jump, 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 jump. Do you know how we'll get through for grannies? I've got an idea. It'll just take a while. We can get going now. I have good news. I found another way to the village. Let's go. Uh, what's wrong? Nothing. Look. It's going to be okay. I bet we'll find your mother there. And even if we don't, you'll be safe. And if he comes back here, you'll know where's the first place to go look for you. Promise? Promise. I'll even leave him up for it just in case. We have to go right now. Can you take me on your piggyback? Sure, kids. Well, let's don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. I'll be right here counting stars. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, if we go back, 
quickly. Let's just make sure we, we're we not, like, missing out on anything. But we can do that just to... Yeah, I think we've clicked on everything. Uh, take the stick with us just in case. Uh, Actually, found something to write first. What about if we use our cigarette? Just save a smoke for later. Something tells me I'm gonna need it. I guess I could use that boom. Burn on a fire, creating some kind of coal based writing implement. Or maybe I could just be an over complicated panel maniac dumbass. I'm trying to get a pen or something. I don't know where we're gonna get a pen from. See what's out the front door. Wide open. Okay. Mm. So we need some kind of pen to leave a note for the mum. to get the cloth dirty that would be a great way of doing so okay what about we we'll use the knife no what about that no so we got ash i'm quickly checking here see if there's anything in here I suppose we could use the hotspot thing as well. Or just feel the power cords. Okay. Uh, maybe. So we definitely can't go back down there. Um, oh, do you know what? I think we can use uh, this way. Actually, it's not this way. We can. Yeah, I think we can. I think it was like um, dung or something on the floor. This. It's just rocks. Okay, that's rocks. Okay, it's rock. Can't go that way, obviously. Hmm. Anything else? No. Okay. Definitely not been that way. Let's go this way. Double check everything. Uh, nothing else around there. Okay, nothing else. 
Maybe if we just walk down here? No. Okay. Okay, nothing around. Oh. Hmm. Some steam off. I hate, hate, hate you. I'll get you ugly. Okay. Wait, I wonder if she'll start to come. Uh, what's your shot? I saw a wolf for reels. Oh, you lying again. Haha, uh -huh, yeah. Then you fell for it again. No, I didn't. Did too. Uh, oh, yeah, there we go. Can I bother a pen? Uh, you don't have to have. Happen to have something to write that with you. I have some pretty crayons. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Uh, I can make do with that. Uh, can I bubble them? Wait. They got old and dirty. We threw them away. Oh, that's a shame. Being a trash can. I'll be right back. I don't want to. Now, so now we know that she got thrown away. They're, they're in the trash can. Right, let's go to the trash can and find the crayons. So obviously when we looked before there was nothing there, but I bet there's crayons there now, huh? I hate going through the trash, but I guess I have to. There, there you go, see? Called it. There we go, crayon. Yep, you found a kid's crayon. Ah, huh? a perfect good crayon. Tossed out into the garbage. Calls it then, I. So there was nothing in that bin before. We checked like twice. Alright. Crayon on that. Let's leave the mum a note. Dear mum, I have kept up your daughter that I found abandoned. <laughs> I have talking to your grandparents like I don't know where they live. <laughs> like what the hell are you gonna write? That was short. <laughs> like what the hell? Well, let's see, okay, I've already written what I wanted to say. Yeah, tell us what you what you written down. There's the notepad. You're not gonna tell us, come on. Wait, at least tell us, oh, we still got the crayon, so that's cool. Let's see, it's not just for writing. There's wax in this. It might come in handy. All right. Before you say anything, have you heard the story about the boy who cried wolf? And nope, I'm a girl, silly. <laughs> Forget about it. <laughs> By the way, I think I found something. That's yours. Really? Show me. I, I, I'm guessing this. I found it in the gar uh, garbage. Would you mind if I keep it? Oh, yeah. That's not mine any anymore anyways. You can use it. What are you going to draw? I'm not. Well, I don't know. I'm, it might just come in handy. Handy? Why? I have no idea. It just might. How come? I am not. Well, I can have it, right? You could draw a red car with it. Or a vampire sucking blood. Ooh. I guess, but... I could draw maybe a pretty red flower. Uh, do you want to have it? Nah, mister, I shouldn't. It's all right, you can take it. Thanks. All right, all right, all right, let's go. Are you ready, kid? Did you leave a note so mommy won't worry? Yeah. It was like two seconds long. Yeah, I did, kid. Okay, let's go. Can you be a piggy? Sure, get on my back. Alright. Scene one escaped from. There you go. Chapter one done. Why did you do that? Do you want me to lock you in the dark place again? Because that's what happens to horrible children. Stop crying. Ooh. Stop crying or you'll regret it. It's 
It's getting dark, this stuff. Right, okay. So now we're down here. We cannot go back up, so it said before. Oh, oh you're heavier than you look, kid. <laughs> I'm not a small child anymore. I'm getting big. But not too but a big for piggyback rides. Never. <laughs> right. Where are we going? Mummy said this way wasn't safe. I know. It's all right. You just need to trust me. Uh. Okay. That was easy. <laughs> Stay here while I look around, okay? Just like you did before. I guess. But if you need help, I'm here. Sure, thanks. Okay, so we got... Oh, we got some kind of electronics. It's this. Oh, let's have a look around then. Always wanted you to drive one of those, okay. Ah. Oh. See nothing else useful here. Unless, are those? Nope, they're just raccoon droppings. <laughs> okay. A silo that completely broken down. Those things are supposed to be steadier. It's the consistency of sand, but nothing like anything I've ever seen before. Same thing, okay. So we can go this way, okay. Well, we have a look around there. Let's have a look around here. Okay, what's this? Uh, danger blasting in operation. The gist of it is this. Touchy bad and you get shot and die. Okay. Great. This looks like fun. Sigh. A plate with screws. It signals whether the power is on or off. Okay, so we've got numbers here. 31, 29, 26, 23, 19, 12, 9 and 3, 6 and 2, section B shaft. Uh, can we take this off? Okay, can we use this for screws? <laughs> it's too thick, right, okay. Uh, what's this one? Ah. Seems to be a turning mechanism. We use that to turn it. Nope. Okay. I guess it's not that way. Okay, this way it is then. Let me just quickly check with the hotspot. Okay, we have got some razor wire. Razor wire. The scariest type of wire in existence. It's designed to cut like no one's business. I guess we can't use that now. Okay. Uh, okay, we've got a trunk and a truck. Let's have a look in the trunk. There you are. There we go. Maybe some tools. What the hell was that? Ah. That might be useful. What the hell was that? Looks like an electric connector. Okay, yeah, let's check inside of there. See nothing else. Are those? No, it's just droppings. Uh, okay, headlights. Ah, I just might have a bright idea. Okay, so was that meant to be a joke? Maybe we can take it out. That's no, it will bend too much. Okay, what about this one then? Those don't go together. Okay, we've got some sand, hold on, oil. Old machinery? Let's have a look in here. That's a lot of tech. Okay, let's have a look this way. Okay, let's have a look at this. What's this? Hammer? Something? What the hell is that? Looks like a small handle. Oh yeah. It works as it must work as a switch. You probably for that thing. Better hang on to it. An old storage building. It's right away, no clear path. Not gonna go there. Okay. 
Uh oh, is that a wolf? Ooh. Well, this is a mess. Are these little sleeves just here? Did they think they were coming back? Oh, did they not just care for some reason? Either way, it looks like it should be worse by now than it is. Uh, we've got a lot of stuff to look around. It's just a silo. Those things always get rusty. Oh, cool. Just leave a dozen barrels of flammable substance in the middle of the forest. What's the worst that can happen? I don't know. Ass hat. Uh, uh, uh. I can't. Maybe. Damn. Can't manage to pry it open, but there is a small gap there. Uh, maybe we can use that thing? No. Thought something happens. Uh, I don't know what. Try that. Ah, I think the knife would fit in there. A little strength to buy open arms. There we go. Yep. Broke the knife. But at least it's open now. Alright, what's there? I struck oil. I'm rich. Alright, so we got oil. Some dirty dishes and alpha cola. Ew, ace it. Alright, so we got oil open for whatever we have got a screwdriver. That's bound to come uh bound to be useful to know later. So we've got some papers. These were left by in the rain apparently. Ew. Something upsetting about wet paper. I don't know why. But besides everything being rotten, looks like they left these here yesterday. Apicola. I'm never touching that sugary poison. Okay, we got a lost diary. Personal journey. Looks fancy. Uh, we take. Okay, May third. <coughs> we got a cold as well, so we'll have to try and shut down that cold. I'll take a false off it. Uh, May third. How rich that this cursed hole in the ground in this uh, uh, fucking bamming village is the place is last chance for survival the yokels say the mines are hex which is just bullshit providence will make it bleed the riches it holds when the right man comes to strike its heart and god will not deny me in such a way i finally got the license for all the workers after creating a uh, addict towards the park every able-bodied man lined up in desperation for work and seem resentful of their fate. I remember when a simple key lock was safe enough, but now things are more, let's say, complicated. Augustine seems to understand. I think that maybe he deserves the privilege of full access. After all, my body is strong, but my mind is blunted by the month. I must not forget. Code 331652. So 33, 16, 52. Okay. That's that's a mine entrance, right? So if we enter here, there's an exit that leads to the park. Also, there's a code, huh? Oh, is that it? Okay. Hold on a minute. Ah. The Pelletus? Somewhere 1965. Must be the journals, right? As on his family. October the 1st. It's inevitable. We all know danger is part of the job. Still, ju just one incident was enough for the Egypt to talk about a curse again. The Egypt didn't even die, but all he had to do was mumble some nonsense as he became unconscious. I forbade any mention of superstition, but I know they whisper as it gets deeper in the mine. We had to stop working for a full day so we could ventilate the, the gas from the tunnels. The time is of essence. I will not be stopped. November the 7th. And we lost several in one single incident. Uh, Augustine tried to gather what happened from those in the group that survived, but they only took nonsense. Looking Gidget insists that we are approaching the devil himself. We dug down some, he even, he even said he saw a demon with his own eyes. <coughs> Between the death 
and those who abandon, I lost five working souls today. Bunch of cowards dare to quit, good riddance. There's evil festering inside that hole in the ground, all right. But it's more nefarious one than those rotten minds can even grasp. Even so, I will endure. Ten minutes second. More fucking death. Now more bastards running away. I got nine less workers and all the rest are starting to mutiny. As if I hadn't had got problems enough. My dumb piece of shit son got with a mewling yokel bitch offered her father money so they keep he said no so we can keep quiet he said no but I know what to do my son hooked by a B word like an effing animal doing all he can to stay my legacy but there's something that's almost funny one last joke from the good old lord See the freaking power breaker. Busted Peter shit. <laughs> Never did work correctly. Always had to switch from one area to another so it wouldn't fry. Well, the number of workers that all remained alive and the dawn off the end of it all, it's the same number of the amperage of the tired machine. Always was that number from the start, diversing energy so it could be used as as long as possible. Good one, Lord. A lot of swearing in that, wasn't there? <laughs> hey, looks like someone was losing their minds. Anyway, there's something here about amperage and number of workers. What? Yeah, something about. What was it? What does it say? I lost five working souls today. And then I got nine less workers. So if you add them together, that's all done. So nine. So we had 14 that were left. Hold on a minute. So 14, hold on a minute. It does say here a minute. Well, the number of workers that remained alive that dawn off the end of it all is the same as the amperage of this tired machine. Amperage. Amperage. To show what that actually meant. Oh. We got a key. This red key might be useful. I'd rather have a whiskey key though. Bingo. Some kind of electric thingy. I didn't believe the jacket. Well, we'll have a look around first. Lots of TV screens, someone sealed it with wooden planks. My experience not a good sign. So I'll check around here and I will check in the door. Maybe if I ever miss around I'll Yep, found something. I'll take it with me. No one will miss it anyway. Oh, it's a thing that bends metal. I forgot its name. It's a uh, uh, tip of my tongue. Damn it. Can't see anything inside. All right, so what have we got? We got ID card, Augustine Ahmad. It's a card, all right. Okay, we got a card reader color code one two three four five six different numbers oh i heard about these it's one of those new thingies they work like keys for doors pretty cool okay what else did we get we've got a key a small key for a small lock screwdriver right righty tighty lefty you see uh let's have a look in let's go look have a look inside then Oh, give me a break. That's a lot of buttons and colours for someone who has no idea what he's doing. Uh, well, if we do this... Oh. Oh, no. Let's say which one's a power or something like that. Maybe that's it. It's like dark blue, 
crimson, red, yellow, light blue, purple, and green. Which of that as well. Right, hold on a minute. So let's that. And then let me just check the picture I've just took then because I ain't going to remember that. Uh, so it was blue, red, yellow. Uh, so it was dark blue, red, yellow, and then light blue, purple, green. Okay, so that's nothing. So it's definitely something to do with this. Nothing lighting up. Let's see if there's anything in the diary again. Just a uh, double check. Says two hammers and a mountain. The company logo. Pretentious much. Something there as well. Let's just double check if there's any kind of like code. We hold on a minute, hold on a minute. What was the code? Three three Hold on a minute. Maybe that was it. Uh what was it? Three three one six five two. So that would be uh, three three yellow yellow uh, sixteen fifty two sixteen fifty two. Right, okay, let's let's try that then. Let's see if this works. So that's the code. Let me write that down somewhere so then I'm not like um I'm paper somewhere really. Uh, so then I can just go like blue, blue, whatever. Uh so other than that, so it's right, so the code is three three one uh, one six five two so that is, and if I do that again, it says, okay, so it's uh, yellow, yellow, uh, the blue, so yellow, yellow, dark blue, uh, and then it's, uh, Six is green, five is purple, purple, green, yellow, yellow, dark, blue, purple, and number two is red. Right. Okay. So let's shut up now. We got. We got that. Okay. So let's have a look. Right. Okay. 
Let's try that again. So we got yellow, yellow, dark blue, green, purple, red. Yellow, yellow, dark blue, green, purple, red. Yellow, yellow, dark blue, green, purple, sorry, red. Ah, there's nothing there, so we need some kind of power. Right, it's not so there's no there's no power going to it so right let's have a look around then no storage building it's run away Screwdriver on the lamp. I wonder what if. Okay, so we've got a wire. Hey, mister. Are you a hobo? Huh? 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 What? Why the hell would you even ask that? Well, my mummy told me about hobos. And you always walking around, getting dirty, picking trash up from the ground, and taking it with you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's okay, I won't tattle. No, I'm just trying to help. Okay, if you say so, just trying not to get any diseases. What? Sure, kid, thanks. Have you ever been here before? Uh, so... You've never seen this part? Nope. When we said it was dangerous. Because people died, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, I heard about what happened here. It wasn't good. What happened? I'll tell you later. Okay. Uh, don't worry, we'll be safe now. Famous last words. Hey, don't sorry. Uh, are those ghosts here? What? No. Where did you hear that? From other kids at school? I don't go to school. Mummy says I can't. I see. Anyway, no ghosts here. I think. Why don't you go? Hey, so. Why weren't you lots in school? Oh. Well, Mummy says it's because of poison? School is poisons? Excuse me. Yeah, I mean, everyone's poisoned. That's what Mummy says. And if I went back to school and be poisoned by them and the people, and because of my heart problem, I can't. And that's why mummy and me are oh, okay. So am I poisoned as well? I don't know. I think you're just silly. But I'd have to ask mummy. Okay. I'll be right back. All right. Don't take too long. So we got, I could use my teeth to expose the wires, but I have bad teeth. That won't do. Uh, okay, so we got, uh, do that. Just need to connect to electrifiers. Hmm. What are the numbers again? 33, 16, 52. Oh, okay, there's nothing there. Section A. Hours on and off. Late with screws. Okay, we got screwdriver now, so we can do that. Righty tighty, lefty loosey. Oh, God, okay. Then why surely won't help? Try that one then. It's too short. If it was only a bit longer, I could make a connection. Alright, okay. Let's have a look. There's always a small voice in the back of my mind that said, just don't touch it. Hey, Renji. New spooky have a game. Yeah, well, yeah, well, we're not too sure at the moment. So, um, we're Graham and we basically we're in we win the woods and we've been we kind of like we're running from wolves 
uh, but we didn't see the wolves, but uh, we just found them. Uh, we came across a cabin with a girl that was holding a shotgun. It wasn't a shotgun, it was a broom. <laughs> uh, it was a stick, actually. Uh, anyway, she basically said that she's all alone, she needs help, and so that's, that's kind of where we are. Um, but there's a lot more to it just like we've um we've been we, the girl said we couldn't go down this way because it was dangerous so we've come down this way anyway and uh we found like it like a like it's an abandoned mine shaft and uh people have just left everything everywhere and uh, there's loads of wolves around so we're not too sure how spooky this actually is but it does seem like kind of like uh, atmosphere it seems to be a turning mechanism okay so we can we can we turn it with that yeah that's supposed to turn in some way but that's a screwdriver won't do it hmm what, what about what about this handle it's definitely from here or am i having difficulty making it fit rusty maybe um maybe we can put oh hold on a minute hold on a minute we we had some oil didn't we uh, where was that oil it was over here Right, so this is the girl we found. Um, th this game, by the way, is called The Night is Grey. Um, it is kind of new, it's not that old. Um, I think it came out maybe like beginning of the year kind of time frame. Right. But yeah, we've just found this diary and a few things around it. The diary is pretty like... <laughs> It's like it's got a few swear words in there and stuff like that but basically it's going on about they were like digging for stuff and everyone thinks that there's a hex and stuff like that there's a lot of code here we're not too sure what the code is yet um yeah so there's a, there's a few things Uh, okay, but there's something, there's almost one joke from the good old Lord. Some See the freaking power breaker, okay. Uh, never did work correctly. Always had to switch one area to another so it wouldn't fry. Well, the number of workers, okay. So they had to divert the energy. So it was broken then as well. Right, okay, let's... Okay, let's have a look at that. Uh, we've got no power to that still. What did it say it, it needed? It needs it to, like a wire or something? Let's have a look. Let me just have a little look around there. We've got a toolbox. Uh, oh, hold on a minute. Can we... Oh, hold on a minute. Can we... It's just fun to play with, but I'm not going to ruin everything. I thought we might be able to stretch it out. Small key for a small lock. It's locked. And I don't see no keyhole yet because it's a key because it's that. So we've got the key card for a bit. And there's like a, a pattern on the back of it, which we're thinking is something to do with the code that we, we've just seen. Um, but there's no power to the door. We definitely need power, but we need, I don't know. Can we stretch that? Oh, there's the oil. Uh, what did he want the oil for? It's this one. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, we're not too sure if it's spooky as such. Um, but, yeah, it's been good up to now, actually. It's been uh, pretty funny, especially the young girl. She, she's hilarious. You're kind of like um, a kind of like a deadpan character. You're kind of a bit more serious. She's like the light comedy in this. In the, she's like she's actually really funny. She'd be trying to scare you and everything. <laughs> like, look, there's a wolf. And you're like, what, what? And she's like, ah, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Right, okay, so we can put the handle on that now. Yeah, we can. Okay, that's much better. Hmm. So, signals where the power's on and off. So, section A, obviously, this is section B. There's always. Okay, but we can't. Can we do anything with that one? Can't see that working. 
we can with that that's too short if only if it was a bit longer so we need to maybe split that or something and i'm not too sure nope uh can we split it with a the key they don't go together okay what if we if the duckies uh <laughs> conductive wow well, so we're not too sure about this we've got 31 if we just click it down There's definitely some kind of cold here going on. Section A, six. And what did they say? We had to, um, they had to split it, didn't they? So if they want to section A on, they'd have to come over here, flip. Oh, let's go look at the line of the diary again. So they had to come over here, flip it to get power. But we don't want really section A. We want section B, which is over here because we want the door active. But we need to figure out how to split the... Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. I think there was barbed wire. Maybe we could split the cable on barbed wire. Is there anything else there as well? The wire will come in handy a bit. Okay. Uh, is there anything else around? Else in there looks... Got razor wire, that was it, razor wire. Let's try that. There's no point in shaving off more, so we can't, we definitely can't split it. Hmm. Okay. suits yeah it's going to be so bring that bends metal we got metal maybe we got is that maybe we could use that no okay okay let's have a look at the diary again let's see what it says again it's obviously something in here two hammers in the mountain company logo can we take the clips I mean, if we can take the clips, we might be able to extend it. No. So we got a code. 331652. Finally got a license for the workers. Uh, I must not forget code. 331652. Okay. Tell us not to forget that, so that's certainly important. Uh, that's the van, obviously. That's the car, sorry. Let's read the journal. Yeah. Let's stop working for a full day so we can ventilate the gas from the tunnels. Uh, we lost several people. Someone said there was a demon. This is a... Between the deaths... The, I lost five working souls today. Bunch of cowards. And there's some evil festering inside of the hole. Uh, okay. uh, got Nihilus workers. Oh, I don't know why is this like, like it's like in bold letters, in bold writing. I got Nihilus workers. Starting the mutiny. Uh, something that's almost funny. Old oh, Lord. Freaking power breaker. Uh, busted piece of. The Never Wolf. I like how it got Wolf crossed out. Work. Correctly. Uh, always had to switch one area to another so it wouldn't fry. Well, the numbers of the workers that remained alive at the dawn of the end of it all is the same number of the amperage of this time machine. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. So, always was that number from the start, diverting energy so it could be used as long as possible. Uh, other minutes we got other minutes we got same number as the number of workers right one minute hold on a minute then 
Right, how many... Right, let's count how many workers then. That we can... Uh, got a license for all the workers. Da -da. Okay, so... We have to stop working for a full day. Right. We lost several in one incident. So... November the 7th. We lost several in one incident. Uh, Trying to gather out for those a group that survived. Uh, so several and one. So several means is that means seven? It's not in bold like this. See, I lost five between the deaths and those who abandoned. I lost five working souls today. Uh, so I'm not too sure. We've got seven, maybe five. Let me shut this down as well. We've got seven, five, just in case. And then we've got nine less workers. And all the rest are starting to mutiny. Uh, ten, uh, seven. Seven, I'm sorry. Uh, so we got nine. Oops, nine. Uh, more effing death. Uh, I got nine last week. So we're five and nine because they're highlighted in bold letters. Uh, if I haven't got any problems. See the freaking power breaker. So I have to switch from one area so it wouldn't cry. Well, the number of workers that remained alive. Hold them. We got to hold on a minute. The number of workers that remained alive, not that went or died. How do we? How would we know how many workers there was in the first place? the dawn of the end of it all the same number of the amperage of this tired machine always was that number from the start what? I, what? So the, num so the number of the amperage is the people that survive not the people that died and ran away several in, in one single incident so seven at five seven well uh, so that's 12 people As well, uh, what's 21, 22, maybe something almost as funny. One last joke, good old lord. See the freaking power breaker, uh, but currently always had to switch from one every two, so we wouldn't. Well, the number of workers that remained alive, well, the sun was alive, he just went. What effing death! I am actually not really too sure how many people died. I'm like actually not too sure.
I, I am absolutely not too sure how many people died. Kind of makes no sense. So have a look at this. So it's the, right. So the amperage is the same amount of people that survived. I don't, that's what it says in the book. I've written down how many people died, which is seven and five. It looks like the the other nine men mutinied, and his and his son just went because he found the woman. So not too sure what so. So we got what's that? Seven, five, and nine. Hold on. It's sure. No. What's the code? 33, 16, and 52. Okay, 33, 16, 52. No, 33, 16, or 52 there. Oh, it's my back of my answers. Don't touch it. It needs new wiring. Oh. Oops. So that wire needs to be attached to that. So we've got the power switches. We're not too sure. The ampage is to people that survive. Well, there must be a lot of survivors then, wasn't there? Because like, like, there's like a lot of numbers here. But I don't understand that. Maybe it's like, I don't know, the lowest numbers. 23, is that there? I'm gonna clue on that. I mean, I, I anyone got any ideas? Hmm. Well, first of all, we need to figure out how to split the wire. What's what's the puzzle? I always want one of these. Uh, is there anything in there? Let's see if we missed anything. See nothing else, unless no, that's just raccoon droppings. Yeah. Let's talk to Hannah a minute. Did you find anything? Yeah, but nothing you'd be interested in. Try me. Got lots of trash. Got some stuff written about some Peloton fellow. I also, oh, I heard that name before. It's a weird name. <laughs> Do you know the guy? I heard mummy arguing with someone. Maybe it was Grandpa. Scream that name out loud. She was mad. Oh, yeah. From what I read, I think a lot of people must have ended up being peed at him. Being what? <laughs> Moving on. Okay. Oh, no. That's the same question that we asked before. So, she knows about the name, but... That's not going to help us. We need to look around for some kind of code or some kind of info. That book is not really helping me really a lot. It probably, the answer's probably right there in front of my face, but. Like, let's go, let's go back. If we can, maybe if we can find some, maybe it's like, I don't know. So, hold a minute, how many? Right, so if we look at that, we got, hold on, 31. Yeah. Uh, 26. Yeah. 19. Yeah. Oh, nine. Yeah. Oh, six. Right. So that's up. That's up. So, and then, so we place them all down. And then we got, okay. So we got 29. Yeah. 23. 
12, 03, 02, and that's down. Okay. Uh, hmm. You got any ideas, Renji? So we need, we've got a key. What's this? Looks like an electric connector. Uh, okay, well that might... Okay, okay, I could use teeth, but I have bad teeth. What, can, you, can she split it? I don't know if she can do stuff. Mommy says you shouldn't break stuff. Okay, well, sometimes you have to break stuff to fix stuff. What are you fixing? Mm, yeah, I don't know, yeah. Ah, oh, I'll get back to you on that. Right, okay, so this is connect there. We need to split the wire to make a connection. We've got a small key for a lock. We've got this as well. Hold on a minute. What's this? Uh, identification. Maybe this is something. 1978. No, he was born in 1938. First of this. 0107. The company logo. Color card reader code. So we've got the one, two, three, four, five, six in different colors. Just tried that. I did that. That's what I've literally just tried. Yeah, she was like, ah, no. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, well, hello there, dumb old man. I'm stalking a bird. Yeah, okay. I know the bird hates me. Okay. Right. Uh, hmm. We. Nothing? No, that's not going to work. Is that going to do anything? Well, just jumping these. No. What about that? No. Hmm. What about if I split it like that? No. What if I tape it and then would have split it? No, that means... Hmm. So, but this is an electric connector. What about, like... Can we take the barbed wire? Razor wire. Uh, we split that onto that. There's no point in shaving more off. No, I don't want to shave it off. I want to split it. Like, that's the only way it's going to... Like, can we not just do it? I could expose it by after bad teeth. That won't do. So you can't do it with your own teeth. Can Ducky do it? No. We just got a handle exposed wire. We do that? No. Unless something happens. No. That's just too short. If it was a bit longer, it would make a connection. So we need. We need. So basically, we need. We, I think we need to split it. I'm not too sure about the section A codes, and I'm not too sure about the section B codes. Yeah. This is. Uh... <laughs> Right, so let's have a good look around then. Is there anything in here? I know what that. Uh, open tank silo. Old machinery. Hmm. That old building. Maybe something. Back to the diary, I think. Uh, let's have a look around. What else is around? We've got... Is it maybe it's something in the pile of papers? Maybe we did we look in these before? Those were left in the rain, apparently. Ew. There's something obsessing about wet paper. I don't know why. Okay, there's someone sealed it with wooden plank. Uh I expect not a good sign. Uh, what a what a what if we do that? Not the right tool to buy them. What about this? Can't see that working. Uh, what about that? Nope. Minus table. Besides everything being rotten, looks like they left here yesterday. See, I think it was, I thought it was this metal press. I think that, uh, I forgot its name. It's, uh, yeah, it's a bit my tongue. Damn it. 
we press start then? It's fun to play with it, but I'm not gonna ruin everything. What about if we do that one? Oh, hold on a minute. Did it do? Oh. Oh, no, I just, I just clicked to walk over there. <laughs> I thought he was gonna do something then. See any keyhole. This is the thing, but there's no power to it. And we thought it was the uh, yellow, yellow, dark blue. And that's the that's the combination for the 33162 in the back of the card, but it doesn't seem to do anything. There's gotta be a right way to do this. If you don't want to bite the wire in half, maybe there's something more the wire somewhere, or you could do the tape to the original. Maybe. Never forget about the tape actually. Let's do everything. Except map, I guess. <laughs> uh be waste. Well, I can't see that working. Well, that no. No. They don't go together. No. Jeez, you look like you've seen some stuff, Augustine. But I want to talk. Oh, I heard about those. It's one of those new thingies. They work like keys for doors. Pretty cool. understand this code thing with the diary this is what i'm not I, if i could use these paper clips as well i could probably like uh, can i oh i can no can i can highlight it company logo wait a minute can i can i get the book nope two hammers in the mountain some kind of written thing there, but I can't, I can't read it. Just gives me this cold again. I'm gonna read this. It's so long to read though. Uh, how long? Hex. The yokels are hex. Uh, Providence makes it bleed. Blah 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 blah. And I got the license for all the workers for creating an audit towards the park. The able-bodied man lined up with desperation to work, empty and resentful their fate. I remember when a simple key lock was safe enough, but now things are more, let's say, complicated. Uh, cold. 8, 3, 16, 32. Now, I, 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 maybe, I don't, they said all of the men. I don't, I don't think there's going to be, like, what? like 330 what you know what i mean like i know it's i know it's a big project but it's not going to be that many people in the line um so i don't think it's going to be that uh that just goes next can we can we take the clip that just goes back right so the clips just go forward and back oh photo tell us this summer 1965 maybe that's a clue Maybe the journal right here. Too sure about that. We can take the sticky stuff off it now. 
So we've got 1965. Uh, so this would be October 1st, 1965, I'm guessing. Uh, it's inevitable, we all know the danger, still one incident, there's enough of these digits to talk about. Guess again, digits uh, don't even, they didn't even die, but it all had to do with some nonsense before we became unconscious. We all have to stop working for full days. We can ventilate from the gas. Then we saw off evidence. We lost several in one single incident. Uh, again, several. Is that, does that mean seven? Or just, just what does several actually mean? Okay, Augustine tried to gather what happened from those in the group that survived. But they only talk nonsense, effing idiots, and says that we're pushing the devil himself as we dug down. Some heathen even said we saw a demon with his own eyes. Between the deaths and those who abandoned, I lost five working souls today. Right, okay, so we lost five souls today. Bunch of cowards dare to quit. Good riddance. There's evil festering inside that hole in the ground, all right. But it's more nefarious, one that those rotten minds can't grasp, even so I will endure. Or oh, effing death, sending more people running away. I got nine less workers. All the rest are starting to mutiny. All the rest, but it doesn't say how many are left. As if I haven't got problems enough, my dumb son got with a yokel offering her father money so they could keep quiet. He said no, but I know what to do. My son, okay, I'm not going to read that bit out. <laughs> Doing all he can to stay my legacy. But there's something that almost funny, one last joke from good old Lord. So, and this is the bit about the generator. This is what I'm not, I'm not this, it's, it's this bit here we need to concentrate on. And obviously it's something to do with survivors but there's something almost funny one last joke from the good old lord sees a freaking power breaker busted piece of crap never did work correctly always had to switch from one area to the other so it wouldn't fry well the number of workers the number of workers that remained alive at dawn off the end of it all is the same number as the amperage of this tired machine. Always was that number from the start. Diverting energy so it could be of use as long as possible. Good one, Lord. It's what I don't understand. Uh, is there anything else that might have hidden wires? And not that I can see. Uh, I can have enough a look around. We definitely need enough a wire. So we've had a, I mean, because we're using the spacebar to have a look around. We have clicked on everything, literally everything. Look oil, rich, oh, cool, just leave a dozen flammable things. Uh, our hat, someone sealed it with wooden planks. Uh, but we can't get in there because we haven't got anything to open it. Oh, that's no keyhole. Red key for a red door. It makes sense, but it won't open a door that's boarded up. Um, maybe we can't, can't see that working. That's not the right tool to pry. Nope. I can't see anything inside. They must have used this to fix out of shape tools. Looks like an intraelectric connector. Out of shape tools. Maybe we can use these cans or something? No.
empty now. Hmm, yeah. And if we can bust open anything electrical. Yeah, that's another thing, isn't it? Well, we've been to the car, and that's where we got the wire in the first place, uh, out of the headlamp. We used a screwdriver for that. Uh, anything in that? No storage. It's not run away. There's no clear path. I'm not going to go there. So we can't go there. Old machinery. That's a lot of tech. Well, wait, wait, let's see if there's anything in there. Those don't go together. No use just bumping them together. What about this thing? Oh, I thought that did something then. I think I got it right. Can't see that working. What about sand? What's, what's this? Sand material. It's just a consistency of sand, but nothing like anything I've ever seen before. Can we get some of it? Nope. Nope. What about that there? Nope. Okay, what about we use the headlight? No point in trying to fix what I just ruined on purpose. Uh, there's nothing else uh, in there to unscrew. Maybe we can. No, it's not the engine key. Looks like it's all that useful stuff. I see that working. Hmm. Yeah, I'm stuck. Already? You, tell me what to do. Do you need any help? Yeah. But I don't think you can do anything, really. Don't worry. Oh, sorry. What? Sorry, I'm not useful. It's all right. You're just a kid. Uh, hey, keep on the lookout for me. And yell if you see anything suspicious, okay? Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Mm. Check someone. I'll be right back. Don't take too long. Hmm. Like, oh, I don't. Uh. Can we? Oh my god, we can go outside of the gate. <laughs> I, f I thought because it was an electric fence, I couldn't go out of the gate. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. The door closed itself. I almost pooped my pants. Uh, hey, bird. What you want? Just talking to myself. You're a real loony, yeah? And that's the real man. No way. New area, yeah? Who knew? Let's see, because it's all barred off. I swear I clicked it before as well, and, it, and yeah? Well, it definitely must be now, mustn't it? Poor baby. And I swear it said I don't want to get electrocuted. So I'd. Like, I didn't think I could go in here. Oh, I like how he's just talking to this thing like he's a like, proper loopy. Uh, you should man up. Stop thinking about useless stuff. And do what you have to do. Help the kid and yourself. Man up, idiot. <laughs> you sound just like father. That once was the door holder, it must have been abused into oblivion. Hi. <laughs> That's it. Incredibly high, high tech. Damn it, it's a busted oil lamp. Right, okay. Oil lamps? Everything else is high tech. Weird. Okay, at least we found a different area. I can't believe that. We've been walking around for a good 10 minutes. Uh, but maybe I can still use the whip. Ah, a whip. Hey, wait. There's something underneath the lamp. Oh, hold on a minute, huh? That might be useful. What did we just get? We got enough one of these. It's a connector. It connects. So we got two of these connectors. They don't go together. Okay. What's that? A workable wick string. We tied onto that. They both are stringy, but 
It doesn't make sense. Graham, you're tired, huh? Well, maybe. Oh my god, there's lots of stuff here. See, look, electrified fence. So you just think that's like electrified? Ah, spare cables. Here we go. Cables. Maybe these are them. Whoa. More expensive stuff that was left in the main. And now it's just expensive trash, idiots. In the middle of all this old electronic junk, there's a wire. Hey, maybe I can use it. Not going to cross into the river. I'll go crane. There must have been uh, tons of things. Wonder what made them abandon all of this. Uh, okay, so we've got our wire at least. Okay, what now? I think I have to power this up. Can't really be the thing. Hopefully they weren't important. It's locked. Keep on pulling, but it's not opening. What about this? E. What fresh hell is this? Loads of information here, but the point is, this turns on the lights in the whole cave. Oh, I must. Yeah. Uh. Oh, hold on a minute. So it's like a puzzle. I mean, they all need to connect. So. that on set the wire yeah <laughs> approved for 91 workers ah hold on a minute 91 so if we take how many people died uh, I think it was 7 and 5 so so it was 91 take 7 take Five, so there were 79 survivors left, I think. I think. Okay, let's... I'm grown man. I'm totally not afraid of the dark, but I'm not going in there. Right, okay, fair days, fair days, fair days. Oh, does it connect the box? Oh yeah, that's the thing we've just looked at, wasn't it? Right, so this powers up everything, but I'm not too sure on the... There's a button pushing it won't work. So we so we need to obviously connect. Then it kind of like... One, two, two, one. I don't know if that means anything. Not too sure. I don't know if all these have to be connected as well. Like... You know, I'm not too... Like, that maybe, and then... That, no. And that, I don't know. That one. That one? No.
Yeah, unless I've got a pattern, I'm not gonna, it might be just completely random. Also, it might not even turn on unless I turn the, uh, the electricity on either. It might not even power on anyway. But right, let's go back. We've got, we've got the, um, we've got the thingy. Uh, I could use my teeth to expose the wires, but I have bad teeth. Uh, can we not just, I could work if they were both exposed. How are we gonna expose them? Can we can't see that working? What if we uh, are we gonna expose them? What's what's what that? A door stopper. Let's see if there's anything in the minecart. Hmm. We <laughs> yep. Okay. Me on the on that. No, it's not that kind of lamp. Nothing here anymore. Okay. We got the wire. How do we split it? How do we expose it? Hmm. Let's see if she can expose this one. I don't want to show. Can you do it? Are you aware? <laughs> no. No. What's that? It's a wick for the lamps. It's my, in my mother's house, we used to use them all the time. Okay. That looks cool. I'm sure it does. Still haven't fixed it, but I'm working on it. Okay, be good, Storky. Hey, Hannah, check this out. You know what this is? What? A new form of key. It opens some doors with magnetism. Whoa. What is magnetism? <laughs> it's uh, complicated. Okay. Um, could we, she can't definitely not just do, no, she can't do nothing. How the hell do we strip a wire? He won't do it with his teeth. Oh. It's got to be something that we've missed. To strip a wire. if we can strip it on the metal things hold on a minute maybe the barbed wire maybe the barbed wire can take the case off the wire off the off because that's what's because the other one's exposed isn't it the yeah so this one's exposed you can see the wires this one's not this one's actually the wire still in the case in so maybe we can use the barbed wire now to, to take the case off or Ah, oh, that could work. Hey, right, okay. So I'm using now. I'm using my brain. Did it, and I didn't lose any fingers. Right, okay. So we can put that one with that one. We're getting somewhere. Cooking now. Right, okay. Right, put our wire in. I'll just double check it. Oh no, we need to. Um, do we need to put some tape on it? See if we can put no use just bumping. Okay, okay, that's fine. Right, I wanted to say how many. Uh, how many people? Oh, what was that again?
84. Also, maybe, hold on a minute. Maybe these, hold on a minute. Right, let's double check our numbers. I think 91. Right, it's 91. Right, so hold on a minute. We got 91. Right, that's how many people started, I think. And then go back to the book and we'll see how many people died. And then that's the rest of the survivors. And I think, I think that we can uh, use them numbers to add up to that number that will power it on. That's what my thinking is. But now we know the number, because we didn't know the number of the, how many people went into the mines. Now we do. So let's go back into the diary and then we'll just subtract that see if that gets us close uh, so it's not that one so we've still got the code though but we think the code's for this door here uh, one, one. right so hold on a minute so we had uh, what was it 91 da, 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 da. right so we 91 okay minus 5 36 And then we got more F, F and death. So we got so I mean, and then maybe take away nine is seventy seven. So if we're reading that right, so this is the same number that remained alive because the people that ran away they're alive. It's just the death. So as far as we know. Five and nine just died. So nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 people died. I lost five working souls today. So they definitely died. And then more effing death. I got nine less workers. And then all of the rest started to mutiny. Even in old son. Well, the number of workers that remained alive that don't know at the end of it all is the same as the average. So we think, so if we're doing our, our right, it's going to be 77 people that survived. We think. So. So if we do the numbers up to 77, and we add them all, then that should be the same, I, I think. Like it's the best guess I've ever got. At least we figured out the wire. It's not long enough. Right, so, right, okay. So we think these numbers here, We'll add up to 77 and then so we've got section a and we've got section b section b is the shaft which is over there and section a is the door we want the door open first so 77 so hold on a minute so right i'll just drop that down so i know what 77 is the number we think Oh. It was, uh, how many people was there all together? 91. 91. Okay, but we. So there was 91 people, and we think there was 77 survivors. Survivors. Right, so if we go. Right, so let's work these out. I've got the numbers up on the screen. So 81. 26, 57, 19, 76. So we're gonna have to maybe knock that down a bit. That's there. So, right, so let's, let's try that. 
So, so, so 29, that's 23, 12, that's 9, 73, that's 6, 79. So we need 77. So that one down as well. Let's read that. Okay, let's go a minute. So 29, 23, 12, 9, 2, 75. So we need two more. Let's have a look at this on a minute. So 29, 3, 3, 1. Oh, got it. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I did it. My math was correct. <laughs> oh, my God. We're right at the beginning of the game as well. This game's going to be like melting my goddamn brain. I did it. You did? Yeah. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> I turned this thing on and now the gate has power. Oh, cool. Well, will this take us to grandma's? Uh, yeah, I mean, eventually. Yeah, woohoo! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Sarcastic kid. <laughs> uh, what is it, kids? We're getting further away from mummy. No, we look, I'll keep you safe. And since we're talking about safety, don't touch the gate or you'll die. <laughs> I, um, but we need it the other way then. We need it the other way to open to open up the, the doors because we don't want it to go down the mine yet. Uh, that only scared you more, I guess. Sorry, ah, uh, you'll be fine. Trust me, just don't touch the gates. <laughs> It's electrified. Okay. Right. So maybe we... Because we still got it. Right. Also, we've saved. Right. But we want to... We want to flip this. And now we've got to... So we've got to... So all the time... Hold on a minute. So hold on a minute. So we've got to... We've got to jot this down. Oh my God. How stupid is this? Uh, right. Hold on a minute. So... So section A is okay, it's 31. Alright. 23, 12, 09, 02. Right, and then section B would be and then we gotta do we gotta do 77 again on the other side. So pick that up. Well, wouldn't that still work? It's the same. It's the same numbers. So maybe that's not it. So set. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Let's go check the door first. That's a lecture file. Let's go and check this door because he said so. He had to switch it over, didn't he? So I'm not too sure if that's. Hmm. And there's also that other code as well. Oh, I'm not too sure. Let's go check this. If this is lit up, it might be. Oh, it's lit up. Forget everything I said. Right, so it was yellow, yellow, dark blue, green, purple, red. Boom. We figured that out before. We just couldn't get in there. Good thing I'm writing all this down. I have a little notepad up and everything. Because <laughs> I will not remember all this. I have great problem solving skills. Yeah, I kind of. I wish I had great problem avoiding skills as well. Alright, let's go check it here then. Alright, so we didn't have to flick it up and down. Okay, whoa. Even for today, this looks kind of high tech. Someone really went overboard. Castles. 
Oh yeah, we got something here we can bend. That's no boomerang. It's all bent up. But it might give me some leverage. But we can we can use that press outside. Alright, so Well, we're gonna there's no telephone poles and miles, so that's an internal line. So we've got a tape recorder. Oh whoa, must be top of the line, very dusty. Otherwise it looks fine. I uh, got some pencils. Now if I find a pen to plenty. Anyway, who needs a pen when you have a pretty red crayon? Uh, we've got a screen. Let's have a look at the screen. Well, every day we're observing here, Dan. There's nothing to observe now. Ah, this camera's pointing at the mine entrance. Bruno, the Bruno Mafamba. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but thanks for the follow. Much appreciated. So I'm happy to call you Bruno. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa, we can move the camera. Hold on a minute. Is that one of them pieces again? Ah, huh? there's something there that I missed. Better go check it out. Ooh. Let me just double check everywhere. Ah, oh, one minute. Oh, so we can rotate both. Hold on a minute, what's this? Oh, I see that then, I see that then. I see it. Some kind of, like... So, uh, is that an anchor? Isn't it? That's an anchor. Okay, that's an anchor. Ah, uh, we've got an anchor. Don't know what it... I don't know what it symbolizes, but we got an anchor. Uh, what else is around? So we got that thing, okay. Was there anything else? Okay, it's just that. Okay. Ah, right, fair dues then. <coughs> Nothing else other than that electrical connecting thing, which I'm not too sure where that was. We'll figure it out though, right? Okay. Right, we're going to get that. Oh, from this perspective, I can clearly see it. I just have to go pick it up. Okay. I will leave it on that. Uh, lighthouse schematics for the lighthouse. Not useful. Shows the machines that we used to mine to the ground. Uh, stinks of bureaucracy. Okay, document unlock. Can we go back to these documents then? I'm not too sure. This with it saying unlock, and we've got like a file or something. So I'm like writing things down here. Uh, mine F FV16, the final report. All the casualties were that high. The conditions of the deaths themselves, November the 7th and the December the 1st, appear to be traumatic enough for the other workers to either abandon the project or organize against the chief of operations, Mr. Pelter. Things started to escalate with physical alterations that might have resulted in more violence if not for the actions of Mr. Pelser's unofficial second hand. According to him, one individual called Augustine, some of his colleagues were either hallucinating or let a fear take the best of them, calming them, cal claiming the minds, claiming, calming, calming the minds started to lure people inside to eat them. Started, what can't it? Claiming, 
claiming. I don't know if that carving or claiming. The mine started the low people are inside to eat them. Uh, when pressed for further explanations, he commented in rather crass way, there must be something in the water. It's unclear if this was just in jest or one of them superstitions held in its kind. In turn, Mr. Pelt himself seemed to be in some way victim of this stressful situation surrounding the project. I believe that there were no sabotage involved, but rather a succession of misfortunes, uh, misfortunes accompanied by the mental decline of an older gentleman like him, a lack of reporting from his past from the incidents themselves to the imminent failure of the project seemed to be more negligent and misguided than malicious. No legal pursuits against Mr. Pelter are available since he also had the tragic end a bit about a, a belt seamlessly through his own hand. The Augustine fellow, on the other hand, should have never take never risen to his position if someone could take the blame for this incident it should be him and the any unwanted attention and there's a regional inspector and there's an id number zero zero one nine eight six that could come in handy who knows this is damn how could they just leave this here for anyone to find it seems like mr pelter was the guy that wrote the journal the wine the mines weren't just safe back then but now they were the only way to escape I don't want to click on that again. Damn it. Come on. Alright, what's that? Alright, okay. What else have we got? She got the mine blueprints. Oh, wow. They were looking to expand the mines. And the business insane. Anything down here? Oh. Uh, this looks like more like security desk than anything else. Got all the monitors. Anything else down there? No. Right, nothing else in there. We're still in there. Uh, oh, we can use the pry tool to get rid of the, the, the plant. One minute. Well, ah, there. Okay. Let's see if I can even do this. Ah, missed it. Missed it. So fast. Come on, missed it. Got it. Just about. One more. Nearly. Oh, and I'm really pressing that in the middle. So close, so close. Come on. Come on. Eee! <laughs> no, I just need to put it in a manhole. And I already regret saying that out loud. Huh. Right, no, you don't. You need to put it. Right, not the right tool to pry off these planks. Come on. It's got to be. Right, okay. So we're going to head into the mines, I think. And uh, we'll see... So I'm gonna have to. I don't know whether I have to keep all this uh, written down as well. I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep it in a note for another day just in case. Save it. Uh, right. Do we need to take you with us? We ready to go? Not yet. I almost promised. Are you scared? No. Of course. How about now? Just have to figure something out. We'll be going soon. Ah, okay. Fair these right. Let's go look in the mine then, I think. Oh, we've got to get that connector. No, we've got to get the connector to connect the things up. Yeah, what the hell now? Oh, that working. I can't cross while it's on. Oh, let's turn it off. Ah, okay. So we can cross now. Uh, where was the boxes? I think it was in there. Ah, there it is. Good thing you got that hotspot thing, because I wouldn't have seen that. Well, well, will you look at that? A finger magic. 
All right, so how do we... So we need to put these together now. So we've got all four of them now. Uh -huh. Basically, I need to get to work. Okay. I don't know when I watch this here. Lots of information there, but the point is this turns on the lights in the whole old cave. So I'm guessing it's got three. I think we've got to fill them all, um, but I'm not too sure. Like, I don't think there's anything that will actually. F like, so can we overlap them? No. That won't do it. They don't go together. too sure if these have to again like, like i'm not too sure if they have to like all of them connect because i don't think you can connect all of them yeah i don't think that would even be possible sure about that yeah we've got the complete set but we're not too sure how to connect them yet like yeah i'm not too sure about this one either but it switches hmm there's no information about them either oh man there's no hmm anything in the uh, I wonder if oh, maybe we missed something in the camera room maybe there's like um, a symbol somewhere or around the camera or something like that oh do we need to switch that back on I'm not too sure if we need to switch that back on we probably do don't we Let's go look in the camera room again then. Let's just see if we've missed anything. Like, uh, there's a diagram or something for them connectors. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure. got this thing as well it's just like a key for a giant lock it says it's for manholes so what you should feel about that uh, so we won't know it. okay it won't it won't look at that now is there anything else uh what is it the report i'll look at the report again there is there so we can't so we can't look at the tv anymore because we've already got the thing so there was nothing else there hmm. 
nothing else in there. Um, can't fire this open yet because we haven't got anything to pry it open with. Uh, I thought it was this to be honest with you, but that's not the right tool. We connect that to that. Wait, can we open it up? No. doesn't work on anything now. Okay. Bit unusual. Now it is. We go there. We'll clear path. I'm not gonna go there. There's nothing around here. No. Hole. Uh -huh. Are you sure about that? Okay. So I don't see any symbols on it from that. So, uh, to go in there so we've got a wick we got nothing to junk so if i left in the cables hmm. but what if it is it's got to be this connector box so i'm not too sure what to do on here Lots of information. But the point is that this turns on the light in the whole cave. Right, so. Let's have a look at this. Now, does this give me an indication of what to really do? It just shows rows of three. Like, like three there, three there, three there, three there. It's got one, two, three, four, five, which is five lights. Five lights there. But the thing is, these can't, these don't overlap. So they can't. Too sure. Yes, yeah, so we got like a, like a one, but we got two, two, two there, two, 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 and one, one, one. So maybe these have to be, uh, like i don't know one and these have to be like double double something like kind of like 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 that would be maybe double double something they're like singular ones oh hold on a minute maybe hold on a minute that connects to that that connects to that that connects to that that connects to that so they're actually all connected this is not connected well, that connects to that, that connects to that, and that connects to that. So, if we do that one. Not too sure about that. That might, not too sure. Maybe we something like that. now okay i think i'm at i don't know if i'm on the right track on that but i think that needs to be connected somehow right yeah, so that is connected to that yeah. 
So I think we've got to make squares that like, 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 yeah, like, like little squares like that, like squares, squares. I think that's the idea of it, but I'm not too sure because you can't overlap them. So we don't know how we'd do that. So that's the best way you can make a square. That'd be like completely random. They don't go together. I can't see that working. Nope. Nope. on this. Mm -hmm. I'll go back. Can we sell it here? Can we? No, they just don't go together. Can't see that work again. They kind of like indication on these. Like, I'm just, I'm just looking for anything really that like meant to really help. Yeah, this is a puzzle I want. I mean, there's not even that many really ways to connect them, but Before we're going to be somehow connected, um, well, obviously, they're going to be somehow connected. To sure how. they connect do they all connect like there's not like i mean i know there's not like things there but then maybe they can i can't see that working yeah i'll do in a minute so that they, they, yeah so that's what i'm saying look they all there's like look there's no there's no break in it that they lit do they look lit now 
at it though. Well, maybe we have to go on top of them now? Like, I really don't understand. Oh, that one's not connected. Maybe... No. That one's now not connected, obviously not. Oh. Yes, so I'm not, honestly, I'm not too sure on this one. I don't know if they have to be all connected. that that's connected to that we just need one to connect to there yeah okay that's all they will connect to that me there's no break i can't see any breaks in that so now do we Maybe if I turn the electricity back on. Uh, so we're not too sure. a few of these uh, let's have a look oh, excuse me Ugh. Ugh. Oh, excuse me. Uh. Go back over here. I don't think we could. I don't think even with a power run, I don't think there's nothing that we can see because I'm just. I think we're on the right track though with the connections, but. So not too sure because it doesn't look like anything's powering up. No, it's just up in there, so. Because if. How do we see that's one of the thing if 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 we connect to there and the electricity has to go through there and we have to flip that, how do we flip that? Maybe we oh maybe we need to open oh maybe we need to open up the gates. That way we can get through. Right, hold on a minute. Maybe I'm I'm a bit daft because then the gate stopper thing. So maybe hold on a minute. Maybe I've got it right. Oh, wrong one. Let's do that. Right. Right. And so there's a gate stopper thing. If that was once a door holder, it must have been abused. Uh, do that. Oh. Not a bad idea, but it will never fit here. 
should work actually. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Maybe we, we maybe we just missed something to hold up the door. There. I screwed the door's ability to close. Hey. Looks like they put a lot of energy. So is that door open now? Yeah, it is. Right, hold on a minute. Maybe that's what we just needed to do. Let's see. Let's see if we're if we if we're cooking with gas now. Uh, don't have to lift up yet. Don't think though, but this is all lit up and we can come through now, so that's one. Oh, hey, are. Hold on a minute. Hey, hey. Right, we are lit up. We are lit up now. Maybe that's what we needed to do. Uh, hold on a minute. So let's. Uh... Is that right? I don't know if we need them all lit up. Oh. Oh, hold on a minute. What the? Um. Do we have to make three different connections then to light them all up? Three there. that one they're connected oh what the uh, maybe loser that can't solve anything now second grade teacher <laughs> whose name I don't recall <laughs> uh, anyway I have no need for these extra connectors now I'll just throw them away famous last words right um, can we go in there now okay here we go okay here we go so this is what father felt every day it was enough of mine of course but it must have felt the same we never knew when he'd come back no he didn't it was a kind of relief but it was also enough of kind of hell mother didn't take it well but the good part of being alone is that you have to learn a thing or two just to get by even if you're not so smart you learn to handle yourself i guess the kids the same huh Anyway, this is kind of dangerous, but we don't have uh, enough option. Maybe I'll understand Father better once we go in. Let's say, God, we have not saved since like we've begun the game. Just, uh, just make sure we're gonna save right. We are not going to carry on. We are going to save it there. I, this has been really good, actually. Hard? 
and actually challenge him. Like, we've got stuck on a few things, but we persisted and we've got through them. It's a very slow paced game, as you can tell. But once we, I think we get into the caves and extreme, I think I'll just stream this tomorrow. I think we'll just carry on with the, uh, with uh, with this for a couple of days. Um, because, like I said, I've been playing Power World and Monster Hunter for the last, you know, uh, like a couple of days and you know what i mean like there's only so much action rpgs i can play <laughs> so this is right up my alley i might just play this for the next two three nights and uh, just to uh, see how it goes um i'll just see uh, who's available to go and raid we love we love our raids on this channel um let's quickly uh let's quickly have a look but yeah i do appreciate right, everyone for joining in tonight let's see who's on again uh okay we got our friend pig mmoshi again um we got anybody else tonight uh let's have a look uh stone maybe if not uh pink mmoshi might have to do I think my most she is. <laughs> the only one that's on. Oh, she's doing some art. Hey, Ben, she's right up your street here. <laughs> there we go. We'll read her, uh, Pink Mamoshi. She's doing some art. Uh, so I'll leave you with her, and, she, and she'll entertain you with a nice art, a nice relaxing stream before everyone has to go to bed. Uh, <laughs> anyway, honestly, thanks for everyone. Thanks for the follows. Thanks for the little bits and everything. Yeah, haha. <laughs> let's uh, let's go read our, our friend uh, Pink Mamoshi, um, and she is draw drawing and having some tea. So let's just go quickly read and. Um, and I'll leave you with her for tonight. Let's start the raid. Okay, and again, we'll we'll play that game tomorrow. So if you want to carry on with the second part of that game, join in the stream tomorrow, and I will definitely stream that game again tomorrow. I thought that was really interesting. Anyway, here we go, raiding. Here we go, Pink Mamoshi. Read. Super into the art. Shrink it a little bit. I feel like this one came out really well. It's so crazy. Chrono Pixel, thank you so much for the raid. You're super into the art. <laughs> Hello, raiders. What are you guys playing? Uh, and we're doing, um, we're working on emotes for all of you people. All of you lovely, lovely people. Uh, I don't know if I want this here. I feel like I do, but I feel like that doesn't look quite right. So maybe like that. Or maybe we do want to pop. No, definitely underneath. Um, what I kind of like want to do is flip it vertically. I feel like it'll look better like that. And then give it a little, give it a little touch up. Yeah, we're working on emotes for everybody. No, it freaking has it, Chrono. I don't know what's wrong with Twitch. Twitch is just like refusing to give me affiliate. It's literally, it hasn't even changed. It says that I'm still at like 7.8 viewers. I mean, 3.8 viewers, Jesus Christ. I can't even do numbers anymore. I've been looking at it. But yeah, it's not on insane. I don't know why, but I'm just thinking maybe it just hasn't updated yet. Or maybe, I don't know. It, yeah, that's what like that's what I was thinking. Maybe it takes a while, it takes a bit. <sighs> it took a while for you too. I'm a riot. It's always hit the sub button. Thank y'all. Oh my god. Low key, me too. But if I'm being honest, it's it's already kind of going so much faster than I thought it would. So it's not like I'm 
like I didn't expect to have this many followers like within my first couple couple weeks of this and so like the fact that I'm there I don't mind waiting a little bit it's just yes now that I'm there I wish that it was I wish that it was a little faster with the upkeep, but you know, Twitch is having a hard time, y'all. Twitch is Twitch is struggling. Apparently, for a stream to have like a lot of people watch a stream in really high resolution, it costs like four grand. I saw what's his name, Pirate Software. I saw him post about that on his freaking YouTube Shorts, and I was like crying, laughing. I was like, what? No wonder they're going like bankrupt and shit. That's crazy. Okay, I like that one. That looks like a really nice highlight, actually. Uh, and I kind of like it a little better as it's like partially, um, partially see through. So I think I'm going to do that with it. Give it a little bit of a see through vibe. And then we'll delete these ones, we'll erase these. So, kind of see. That's what we're working with. Yeah, I've been working really hard to try to get my emotes, um, to get them, what's the word? I keep forgetting the word. Um, get them matching. They're looking amazing. Thank you. So these are the guys so far. Um, they just need to be consistent. They needed to be consistent across the board. Um, and for me right now, like I'm out of practice with my graphic design, like pretty badly. I used to do work with it full time, but um, right now I'm out of practice. I'm rusty as all heck. So we're working on these for a little bit once I get a few of these done and get your guys' feedback because in reality, you're the ones who are getting to use them. Not so much me, like I'll use them once in a while, but they're really for you guys. So I wanted to kind of do this with everybody um, and get that live feedback so that I can make sure that you're happy with them. <coughs> um, because it's it's a group process. Stickmen! We love stickmen here! Ain't nothing wrong with stickmen. Definitely nothing wrong with stick men. Um, but I use like reference photos, so they're not like fully from my brain. They're they're inspirational. There's they're from a lot of other a lot of other pictures and info. Oh no worries. Okay, so I I guess I didn't follow you before when I thought I already was, and so I was I was looking at your channel and I was like, oh fuck, like I'm not followed so I, I followed like I sneaky I sneaky followed last night it was like two in the morning and I was like what the fuck <laughs> you've subbed to one per person for over a year solely based on their emotes dude that's actually hilarious puffin but honestly I believe like that's a valid reason I'm a big art fan so I get that I buy posters Sometimes I buy a poster and it's like two, uh, not 200, that's really expensive. But I will buy like really nice posters, sometimes it's like 60 bucks, and so. What do you mean I didn't have to? <laughs> we gotta support each other, what the heck? We just gotta support each other. Speaking of, uh, Puffin, the one I raided last night on your wreck, she actually followed me back. Uh, Lunatastic. So we're hoping that we can put together a joint stream at some point. So I'm excited for that, to do Monster Hunter or something. Okay, for this one... Do we want a red mouth? <coughs> Yeah, that's, I kind of got that feeling from her as we were watching together, and yeah, I really got the the feeling that she's really cute, very positive, she doesn't really swear, I swear more than I should, um, and so that's the kind of people I like to follow. Uh, I don't know if anyone here has seen Gab Smolders, but she is one of my absolute favorite streamers of all time. Like, she is just absolutely insane. Um, 
she does a lot of the same kind of games that I love. And so that's where I see a lot of ones that I really like too. Ones that I really like though, I have to like watch the first five minutes and then turn the video off so that like I know I want to get it and I don't want to spoil myself so I have to like stop it. <laughs> uh, what do we want for the tears? What color did I use for these? So let's go for a lighter version of that. 